Right, so uh, it's now the following morning, and every time I spawn here, I seem to be stood on a chair for some reason. Maybe there's rats in the camp, you know. The rat in the kitchen, what am I gonna do? It's a rat in the medical kitchen. It's a medical tent, actually, isn't it? So, um, I was just messing with the. Uh, look, I destroyed my camp by moving. I was thinking I was moving this. This is outpost 4 that I wanted to move to there. So I'm going to nip back out there and put um, my cover back in. Oops, what am I doing? Bash through the gate. Get out there, woman. The annoying thing about the control on my game here is um, <coughs> that the I think I've got a little bit of lag but also my mouse moves too rapidly keeping them squares on the floor Uh, zombie fair. Oh, it's a fast one. Looks like a good spot for an outpost. Really? Are you sure? Yep. Try and touch me on the shoulder there. The fast one's wait. I'm waiting for the fast one to come and get me. Um, never mind. Whilst we're waiting, we'll go over there. Well, I had this all sorted the other night, but what happened is um, my guy disappeared. I was doing a search and rescue mission, and the guy that I was uh, recovering, he vanished as I walked him through the gate. If anybody else has had that problem, and uh, I think this is the place. Let's just sort him out. I like the sound it makes when it hits them on the head. And map. I'm in the wrong place. Typical. Public restroom is the one across the road that I want to be in. Yep. So what I don't get it is how a machete can chop through his helmet, whereas an elephant gun bounces off his um, bounces off his helmet when you're shooting at him and we want don't tell me this because I've, I've positioned and enclosed these women outposts about three times here let's do a runner back to the camp you can see I know my way about here That was somebody having an accident out there, I think. Yes. Because I've got these um, things happening. Let's put a call out there for some more um, stores, because I've only got five left. And when you put a call out on the radio, if you didn't already know it, it actually does um, spawn the materials or fuel or ammunition, meds, food at a random point in your map so even when you've completely raided all the buildings and they're all empty and you're saying oh, there's no more people to be rescued there are because all you have to do is just go and spawn some more the only thing is it takes time of course so at the current time it's taking nine minutes so what I do is on my other PC I have a little timer set 
and uh, every 10 minutes it reminds me pops up and says just look at all your your points so it reminds me to keep these things running like you can snipe a few of the vid the zombies that always gets you a few extra points um, we could have a meal and I always choose this one because it says additional vitality and stamina bonuses for everyone high likelihood of needing special ingredients requires a cook good cook which is 20 percent max vitality and 10 percent max stamina for everyone but if you go to this one it's only max vitality for everyone um 20 percent and i've just clicked it by mistake i aren't going to stop it i'll just let it run so i'll let it run i do it all the time so it doesn't matter really another one there additional 10 percent stamina requires a fitness expert 10 minutes so there's a tip for you put a timer on um, perhaps um, you know if you've got a timer on your mobile uh, make some more flame for glasses these are all, always good for dropping randomly in the street I always try and take you know a few of those out with me and just put them down randomly in the street and it always burns a few zombie hordes uh, especially if I don't want to damage my car and um, I'll take some of those out just to rattle them off I can't build the next one up yet because I haven't got enough materials and I haven't got enough materials to build it and or space to build a munitions um, workshop so I'm workshop at the moment um, is fixing cars so that's how I've got it geared up. Um, I don't need um, to create any more biodiesel. I will just turn some of my food into new recipes, opens up new recipes and prevents against spillage and preserves food. As you can see I've got plenty of food although I haven't got a greenhouse or a garden anymore. I've got plenty of meds. Some of the meds are going off because I haven't got enough storage. Um, I haven't got enough munitions, so I'll be putting out a call for munitions next, but desperately I need this and uh, materials. And I've got more than enough fuel. So you can also put calls out for people who want to trade. Um, I can't do that currently because I've already got something else on the radio. So that's just about everything covered, what I can do. In there, I've got the kitchen running. Nothing I can do in the cars, you know. Tells you where the parking bays are and stuff. So that's just a rundown of where I am in the Trumbull County Fairgrounds. As you can see, it looks like this. And that base there should actually just be one over, and it helps just cover that little gap. Um, the buildings are just a little bit too far out to overlap in white but once you get that one in moved over it seems to fill all that middle area as well anyway so don't worry about that we'll go and kill a zombie I'll take one of my cup cars I think let's go and do a runner and uh, I did make a video that's posted on the channel. Look, okay, so if you could see the last video I made where I messed up, I parked a car there, and this car was all battered to hell out of it. You'll see in the last video, which is a little bit disjointed, because um, I was making them in 30 seconds clips. Uh, mission Z Hunter. And there was another mission that's just come in. I don't know where that is. Right, so that's where I was. I was in. I did have my. Uh, it was just there. It was the Snyder trucking, and I moved from there to where I am now, because it's a bigger outpost, bigger, uh, bigger thing. Fear itself. Where's that one? Oh, there, there she is someone is talking to. We'll go and get them talked to first because we can take them with us.
and it helps watch our back for free because um, but you've got to be careful that if you're taking out the wrong person at the moment I'm playing as Haley Bear, Bear and basically she has been crap um, you know fighting's come up real good I've been working with her for a while and the construction's good but normally when I first got her she had all just one stars uh, the person you don't want to damage is Lily Ritter because she's on the radio and uh, the other one is the uh, oh she's a good fighter uh, Maya Torres the other one you don't want to injure is the guy who's the medic and the guy who's the gardener although they keep throwing themselves out in missions um, Oh yeah, it's this guy. Who's this? Let's take him out for a walk. So I, I think everybody does this. I'm not showing you any secrets here. Everybody takes out the guy, does a few missions of their own. I'm not going to shut the door. Get in the car. I usually check my health packs to make sure I've got enough health packs and stuff with me I've got plenty I, I sort of like know that when I try and wind up a game as well this same conversation that goes on we'll go and sort these zombies out just to knock down the horde two hordes Get out of the way, people! And that's that. Uh, uh, this video, incidentally, follows all the rules of uh, YouTube it's got commentary on it and it's from um, return to mission area what mission area what mission area does it want me to go to oh there it is right I suppose so we'll do that if that's what you want us to do You didn't do nothing, did you? Okay, I'll follow your lead. You okay. better do. Right, we've got another minute before we end this video. And we'll be back in the next... Um, in the next one. So generally I'd like to finish that mission up. But... Um, If you run over people slowly in your car, you won't do much as much damage to your car. I'm not bothered about them guys. The thing that I was going to take this guy on the trip with, um, shall wait till the next episode, so I will just stop here, I'll pause my game. Um, just to remind you that uh, if you like this video, please remember to subscribe and um, like the video as well, because it helps the channel. Uh, this is... a relatively new channel um, as of September 2014 I'm making this video on the 5th but um, that means nothing I've been playing the game for a long while actually but um, as you can see at this point and I played it a little bit before when it had the uh, there's my timer just tell me 15 minutes are up and um, we'll we'll come back in the next video so if you want to see what happens next and have a look. Uh, this video follows YouTube's rules um, of having commentary on a commercially um, licensed and publicised game, um, publicly available game, blah 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 blah. So.
and there's no background music involved in this game so in video thank you